Hey guys, Rudolph here, and I'm coming at you with a late Christmas unboxing of one of the presents that I got for Christmas. So let's go ahead and dive in to one of my presents, which this just so happens to be my favorite one that I got so far. So, I got the Potato HD, which is a really nice capture card in my opinion, and I have a lot of friends that use it, so I decided to get the Potato HD, and I, I think that this is all that comes in the box. It's right here, actually, it's for my Potato HD. But, let's go ahead and start, is this an audio, it comes with an audio cable, which I actually didn't know about, so, I do have a little speaker right here, I can, I can test out the audio, let's, let's see, um, cable goes right there, and, let's see, is this the other end, yes it is, okay, let's find it on my, right there, okay, plug that in, now I just gotta, I just gotta find the play button. I honestly don't know where it is. Okay. Why does it have sale on it? It actually sounds pretty good though. Huh. Okay. I'm liking this potato. I like their choice of music that they put on it. It's pretty nice. Um, how do we stop it? go home. Now, one of the other very important things about the Potato HD is, of course, to capture your game quality in HD. And in order to set this up with your PS3 or Xbox, you just need your original AVI cables, which I just so happen to have right here. And, all right, good, let's go ahead and get my potato out of my box. You have to make sure that you plug the cords in correctly, though, but because many of my friends have Potato HDs, they kind of showed me how to set this up before I made this video. So, Make sure that you're plugging the cords in on the correct side because you do not want to plug it in on the audio side because you could mess things up on your Potato HD severely. So, the very first color that we want to plug into our Potato HD is we're going to hit, we're going to use yellow. Then we're going to plug in white right next to the yellow. It's right there. And then we're going to plug in our red one next to our white. And now, this should send really good, high quality HD to our PS3. Now that that's all set up and whatnot, I should have it all good. Now that that is set up, all that I have to do is I have to plug in a USB to the side of my potato. And I don't think I have any USBs on me, so I'm going to go ahead and plug in, let's, let's plug in a shotgun shell, just, just because, let's put this shotgun shell right up in here, instead of my USB. And now, my Potato HD should be recording all my gameplay to my shotgun shell, but, um, I don't know, I feel like this, I'm not sure how much game quality this shotgun shell can even hold. And it's not it's it's not a shot shotgun shell yet. I haven't used this, so I'm not sure if that'll make the quality better or if that'll make it worse, but I guess we're gonna find out. So that is the setup of the Potato HD, my favorite Christmas present, and it should work really well with my PS3. It plays audio and everything is gonna go just fine. So if you like this unboxing slash setup, please click the like button because I'm Rudolph, and as always, thanks for coming by, click the like button, subscribe, and do whatever it is you do on Call of Duty.